Germantown, Maryland. Good evening and welcome to our next episode of Cooking with Michael. And Canvas. We are... And Canvas? I said Candace. Oh, maybe it's the back pain. I have back pain. Maybe it's the back pain medicine. Pain does tend to make you loopy. It does. Okay. So anyway, we're back. Thank you all for watching last week. Hope you enjoyed the guacamole. We hope you tried the guacamole. We had a little bit of a... a, a Advertising blip. But anyway, so tonight... We're actually going to make a nice little dinner. You'll enjoy it. It's quick. And we'll tell you why in just a second. But first, as always, well, actually, really first, we are live in front of our studio audience. We have an audience out there of thousands of people watching us in the show um, in the background behind the camera. So thank you to the two of you um, for being there watching, our boys. Um, anyway. <laughs> and then there's the cats. But if you are in the Germantown, Maryland area, and you're looking for the best selection of beer and wine in all of Montgomery County at the best prices, where would you go? Chapel Beer and Wine in Fox Chapel Shopping Center. Ask Andrew, and he will hook you up. There you go. So thank you, Andrew. You've been there with us all along. All right, so tonight, um, let's, you have your date night dinners. We do our date night dinners, date night appetizers, date night side dishes, um, Halloween stuff, what have you. But let's just say you're having a date night dinner. Um, you're single, your family's way out of town, you have to work that day or, or work the day before, work the day after, Black Friday, that kind of thing. Yeah, or you're a young couple and you've both had to move for the job for, of one of you. Right, you exactly. Um, and you don't really get a chance to go home and have that big old family dinner with all of your cousins, aunts, uncles, brothers, cousins. You, know, you want to make, but you still want to have that little bit of turkey because everyone loves turkey on Thanksgiving. So um, we're going to show you how to make turkey in an air fryer. Quick. Quick. So you can have the rest of the day to watch football on Thanksgiving and maybe a little uh, also um, with that person. Anyway, so what we're going to do is we're going to make turkey. We're going to use turkey legs because that's our favorite. And they cook faster than, obviously, than cooking the whole dang bird. And you don't waste it because you're not eating the whole dang bird. The bird goes bad after a couple days. Yeah. Yeah. So, um... Because when I think turkey, I think, oh, God, it's going to take forever. It's going to be dry. Yeah, no, thank you. I'm not messing with that. But this guy is the master of turkey. Master! All right, so we're, as she said, we're going to use turkey legs. Um, you can use, they come in thighs. You can get them pieces. You can get turkey breast, things like that. The turkey legs is what we use. Very simple. We're going to take three turkey legs. Just like that. Make sure they're thawed out. Okay, you don't want to do them frozen in this. I got this at just one of your big box, regular gold chain grocery stores. Mm -hmm. uh, they're fine. It's turkey, 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 turkey. So, anyway, we're going to take a little bit of olive oil. And I'm basically going to spray it on. Okay. And then I'm going to turn it over. I'm going to spray it on. And for you, you know, super noob cooks, make sure you use one hand for touching the turkey and one hand for touching the olive oil. You don't want to cross-contaminate and contaminate your surfaces. That's correct. And then you want to basically rub the bird, basically I'm rubbing meat. I'm rubbing oil into my meat. This is happening. This is happening, facts. You want to, so basically you want to make sure is the olive oil coats the entire leg, okay? All right, so after you do that, Season off, or season salt, whatever you call it. We use a, a, a brand name that I won't mention because they haven't sponsored us, Morton's. Um, season all. Um, if you want to sponsor us, Morton's, that's www.cookingwithmichael.us. Um, and uh, check us out, please, Morton's. And of course, sponsor us. We take all kinds of money. Anyway, um, so you want to take some season all, and all you're going to do is you're going to open up the part that's a shaker, and you're going to shake it on the turkey. You want it to be almost coated. Right. We put a lot on there. It's very thick, dense meat, so it can handle it without being overwhelmed. So what we did is I'm going to show what it looks like. All right, tall person. You ready? Mm-hmm. Tall people, tall people, tall people, tall people. Okay, so this is what it looks like. As you can see, it's basically just three turkey legs covered in olive oil with uh, some seasonal on it. Real simple, right? All right, so now we're going to use the air fryer. As you know, if you've watched our shows before, first of all, thank you. Um, keep watching, keep clicking, keep liking, keep subscribing. Okay, we use our Instant Vortex Air Fryer. Um, it's actually our favorite. Um, it's our favorite because it's the one we have. Um, but actually, it's really good because it's a multiple tool. It does a rotisserie, um, it does air frying, it does baking, roasting, all kinds of stuff in there, dehydrating. So it's a good one because there's a, it's a multiple tool as opposed to just an air fryer. But on this case... Plus... Oh, I'm sorry, she's gonna jump in. You know, when you can use it you know, as an oven when you're baking or broiling, um, this also is much smaller than your oven. So if you're doing a small amount of food, why waste the electricity on heating up your giant oven 
right? It's gonna save you money, and it's gonna save the world a little fossil fuel. It's just one of the many little things that add up. Tree now you may continue. Tree hugger music. Okay. So anyway, so the air fryer, the, 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 all good points. No, I'm just kidding. All right. So the, <laughs> so the, the uh, there you go. So the oh, I hit I, I hit it. It made noise. Anyway, so uh, we it use the size with me. It says yes. Uh, I'm, so. I'm better. I'm more eco friendly. Fuck you. <laughs> Facts. So we're gonna put on an air fry. 400 degrees, it's already set for 400 degrees. And then we're gonna set it for 20 minutes, which is already set. And then we're gonna turn it on to warm it up. Now, let me be very clear about this, okay? While it's warming up, you wanna get ready. Do not put your chicken in there. Or... Turkey. <laughs> Do not put your turkey in there while it's heating up. Um, it'll screw it up. So you're gonna put turkey in for 20 minutes. And then when 20 minutes is over, you're gonna turn the turkey over. Now, if you've watched the show before, like we said, thank you very much, keep watching. Um, we tell you it, you know, it because of the, the way it is, the air circulates around it. Um, so you really don't have to do that on a lot of things. On this you do because you do wanna have it crispy all the way around. It makes the, the flavor even better. It also helps secure in those juices better um, with this, with the air fryer, because you don't want it to be dry. You want, yeah, you want those juices circulate through the meat and get trapped in that skin. So well, we'll, let the, we'll let this heat up, and when uh, when it's done, we'll, we'll put it in, and we'll show you the next step. Be right back. Real quick, while this is heating up, there are things you can do. You know, you're making a uh, Thanksgiving uh, meal for two kind of thing. You can use uh, stuffing. We use the instant one. Okay, this one is, I'm not gonna mention the name of the grocery store, because it's not Aldi. Wegmans, so sponsor us. Anyway. Box stuffing is fine, is what he's yeah. saying. Yes, cranberry sauce, um, po or canned, not box, because if it comes in a box, it usually leaks. <laughs> Canned cranberry sauce um, is fine, canned corn, can whatever you want to add to it. Open up a nice bottle of wine or six and have yourself a great time. But um, instant stuff is really good when you're trying to make a very quick uh, Thanksgiving meal. So, all right, you can hear beeping, it says add food. So we're gonna open this up. We're gonna take just one. We take just one of these. And we're gonna take and we're gonna put these on. You can do it fairly quickly because you don't want it to cool off. So it looks like that on the plate, on the tray, stick it in there. Add food. Add food. Close it back up. Let it do its thing. Again, make sure it's set for 20 minutes, which it is. Um, at 20 minutes, it'll shut off. Flip it over, turn it back off for another 20 minutes or less. Keep an eye on it. We'll be back when uh, this is uh, done for the first half and uh, we'll show you what's next. T minus 18 minutes and counting. All astronauts to the capsule. T minus 18 minutes and counting. All right, it's stopped. We've done it for 20 minutes. We'll show you what it looks like. We'll take it out. All right, so this is what it looks like. Slightly brown now. It's going to flip them over, okay? Beep. Stick them back in. We're gonna do air fry again. Just keep it for 10 minutes and hit start. One thing to keep in mind, um, so we did it for 20 minutes. We're doing it again for a second 20 minutes. It's really gonna depend on the size of your legs or if you're doing wings or breasts or whatever else. So um, keep an eye on the time. So in about 10 minutes, I'm going to check it, okay? Um, and you wanna make sure your turkey's done. 165 degrees internal temperature with a the thermometer. Um, fuck that shit, I'm gonna cut it if it's brown all the way through or if it's cooked all the way through, no pink, um, and it cuts easily, it's done. Juices run clear, okay? That's how you do it. Juices run clear, no pinkness in the side, you're good to go, okay? But anyway, so we'll check it again in 10 minutes and then uh, we'll be right back. All right, we are back. So, uh, it's actually, it's only, we got about eight minutes left of the 20 minutes, so it's been about 12 minutes. Matt, you like that? All right. But it looked like it was almost done earlier when we checked on it. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and take that out. It's, it's done. So we're gonna go ahead and take these out, show you what they look like. Tall people, tall people, air fried turkey legs, tall people, tall people. All right, so now we got them out. We're gonna taste them. We're gonna do. Typically, we would just pick up and eat them like you know we're freaking savages. But oh fuck no, not when they're this hot. They're fucking hot. We would hot. burn our lips off. You gotta wait a few minutes for them to cool before you shove your face in them. See all the steam. Fuck, that's hot. So I'm gonna cook wait. You, cook the mic without you listening. So I'm gonna wait for it to cool. All right. <laughs> Mmm. Super good. 
Excellent. So it is, it's, it's juicy, it's done all the way through, it's not dry, mm -hmm. it's tasty, perfect. Air fryer does a great job with it. If you don't have an air fryer, we highly suggest you get one. Again, we like the Vortex air fryer and know they're not paying us, but you could. Click on my good US, email us. Um, but uh, if they're not, really worth the counter space. They really are. They absolutely are. And if this, if you want a different kind of air fryer, air fryers in general, great, great product. Um, makes this food really, really quick. So it's a great date night dinner. Again, you can make uh, your stuffing, you can have bread, you can, you know, whatever you want to make extra. Um, cranberry sauce from a jar, from a can, what have you. So anyway, that's it. Um, that's what the turkey looks like tonight. We're going to eat now. We have our little date night and um, with our kids because they're probably out in the audience hungry as well. Um, and then we'll be back and we'll, as always, please make sure if you haven't, click that little subscribe button underneath the video and of course share it uh, with everyone you know, everyone you like, everyone you work with, all your friends, your family. All the people you hate. All the people you hate. Um, you know, anybody that, that, that person that's walking down the street that says, hey, I could really use a good turkey minute, dinner, um, you know, ask them if they want to try a recipe and show them the video. Um, and uh, as always, we'll see you next Saturday night, 8 p.m on Cooking with Michael and Candace and Candace. Good night everyone. Good night. turkey in there twice. No, you're not. You're not going to do that. <laughs> what the fuck are we doing? All right. It depends on how I edit. We might put our turkey in twice. It could be. Hey, this is gone. Na, 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 na. Na, 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 na. Hey, hey, hey. Fuck you, Dan Snyder. Na, 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 na. Say it with me. Na, 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 na. Hey, hey, hey. Fuck you, Dan Snyder.